guys coming at you in the middle <clears throat> in the middle of the night here a quick update something came up in the middle of the night I was hanging out with my buddy outside saying bye to him we hung out he came from out of state to visit I hadn't seen him in a long time so uh got cut short on work earlier had some errands come up had to cut the day short gonna get an early start tomorrow but as I was outside talking to my friend tonight a cat walked up and out here as far away from everything as we are it doesn't just happen so I think so I just dumped him out but take a look at this cat very very beautiful haven't found out quite yet if it's a boy or girl managed to get it inside opened up a can of chicken and ate probably it's a 12 ounce can of chicken it probably ate at least I mean that's all that's left out of a 12 ounce can it just filled its little belly up now it's just purring look at that cat look at that cat yeah I got your back kitty cat get your belly full Unfortunately, I don't think I can be keeping a cat right now, so we'll have to find a home for it. Good little kitty cat. To probably take it to a humane society here. We have a no-kill humane society, fortunately, um, within about 25 miles from here. Costs a little bit of money, but that might be an option. I uh, might use the old Facebook to post some pictures. And see if anybody around here that I, I know I can trust would be willing to give him or her a home. But in the meanwhile, guys, think of a good name for this kitty cat. It might be in my possession for a day or two, depending on how everything goes. It's a good name. All gray. Beautiful eyes. Soft hair. I'm thinking somebody dumped the cat out here. It does happen in this area. A lot of people kind of come by the animals they don't want. They don't want to pay the fee at the Humane Society. They just dump the animal out in front of a house that has a light on and drive off. They are, in some way, maybe they might feel like they're doing the right thing for the animal. And in some way, I suppose they're right when it's compared to straight up just maybe terminating the animal themselves um i still it's it's wrong you know we we should come together as communities and use the social media connectivity that we have to find homes for pets like these instead of just strand them because a domesticated animal has a very small chance of survival in the wild now a cat she does seem to have all of her claws still or he this cat seems to have all of its claws still and um so it cats can hunt mice and and they are um you know they are killer carnivores they they are domesticated but they can survive in the wild a lot more than like a dog probably could but still um with dogs being as prevalent as they are on farms in the area this cat probably couldn't make it there's cat packs of coyotes that would that would get it you know it's it can hunt prey but most of these cats can't really defend itself against predators in the wilderness. So we're, we took it in. We're going to do the right thing. Maybe it wandered up here. It did eat a lot of chicken, uh, that, that chicken. So it, it, it's very possible that it wandered for, uh, you know, a distance of multiple miles and got here. And it was just hadn't had food for days. It is possible that somebody who is neglectful to the point of dumping a cat is also neglectful to the point of not feeding the cat adequately and is hungry from that. Regardless of the possibility, it's not the kitty cat's fault. We're going to make the situation right. And, you know, I, I like cats. So in the meantime, I, I'm going to get something out of it too. And hopefully you guys get something out of it as well. But it's very late in the middle of the night here. Just wanted to post a quick update in here for you guys. Um... Got a lot of work to do tomorrow. Pretty excited to get up and get started. But first of all, I gotta get cleaned up and get in bed and get some sleep. So, you guys probably may need to do the same, depending on what time this video goes up. But this is Levi Casey checking in from the headquarters, and I will catch you soon. Good night.